I guess they were right. I did. And is this Monster Mash? Monster Mash. Monster Mash. Now it's from a movie, isn't it? No, no Monster Party. Is it really from the Mash? Did the monster. <laughs> now, is it really from the Mad Monster do you, Party? Do you remember Mad Monster now, Party? That was a claymation. Wait a minute, I forgot. Uh, hi, I'm Tom Fawn. Oh, and I'm Jonathan Fawn. And this, this is, is Magic, Magic Moments, Moments with, with the, the Fawn Fawn Brothers. Brothers. And it's our special Halloween show. Now, I love Halloween. Halloween. I don't like orange and black because those are giants' colors, but I do right. love Halloween. Uh, Mad Monster Party yes, was sir. a uh, like animated uh, marionette movie from the late 60s that was very funny and i think monster mash is from that i'm not sure but uh, can we talk about halloween i we mean can talk you know about, as a grown-up it's about everyone barely as a grown-up halloween doesn't have a uh, tremendous it's all about the kids but do you remember when you were a kid and you couldn't wait for halloween halloween was uh, very very exciting in fact i remember if you could still have candy by july 4th that was a real That's crazy. thing you'd have to put something away all i remember that. is we had pillowcases before we had the uh, we had the uh, uh, we had the uh, pumpkin we had pillowcases that we used to put oh, the like candy. So mom would, oh, all yeah. right. We would we take put, our pillowcases yeah, yeah, out with yeah. us to carry right. the candy in. And then we'd, when we got through the neighborhood and we got all the candy, then we had to, if you remember, go see uh, the old man. And what would he do in the kitchen? Uh, you told me that story. Tell, tell the people. Oh, right. So we would bring the candy home after our successful run. Right. We got and the, the old man would say, lay all your candy out on the kitchen table so I can check and see that there's no razor blades in it. Right. That so was a we big would, thing. So, apples and razor blades. So we had our own little pile of candy. He goes, uh, what is this? Are these brownies? Yeah, you can't eat those. You throw the brownies. And people would make you stuff. Right, Remember right, that? Right, it's right. like, I made you kids baked apples. Right, it's like, that's right. really do, nice. Do, Thank do you. Do the voice as the, our one fan. Go ahead, do it. Hey, hi, you guys. You want some baked apples? Yeah, okay. There's no razor blades in it, but you might find a bullet. All right, so... Um, so my old man would look at everyone's pile of candy, right. and he would go through it and say, all right, this looks okay, this looks okay. This Mr. Goodbar looks a little suspect. Yeah, I better put it away. <laughs> now that the old man loved Mr. Goodbar's. In right. fact, I'm putting it directly in the freezer. Right. So, <laughs> well, what he would do is he would take a little bit from all four kids. Is what right, it'll import wait, wait, wait. duty. Let's talk, let's talk favorite uh, chocolate candies, or favorite candies when you were a kid. Yeah, now that's what I'm trying to remember. Yeah. We were talking about this earlier. When I liked a zag nut. A zag nut was it what? It was coconut. It had coconut in it, you know. Coconut? Yeah, right. And now, then, wait. Uh, yeah. If were candies yeah. when we were kids, yeah. did they give you yeah. the full candy bars? No. They gave or was you the that little, little minis when we were kids? Yeah, little, little minis. I like the Nestle's Crunch Bar. Nestle's and, Crunch uh, yeah. Snickers. And I also like You want to get Snickers. Yeah. If they were Snickers, you knew you had something good. Yeah, I used to like this sp- one. You yeah. brought it up. Well, called the, a, the, it was called a marathon bar. Yeah, it looked like a And it looked like a... Looked like a chocolate a chocolate chain, caramel chain, like a chocolate chain. Yeah, and you also mentioned Clark bars. Yeah, I loved Clark bar. I can't remember what it. It's kind of like tasted a, like, but I remember I loved it. It's like a Butterfinger. It's very much like a Butterfinger. Ooh, and what about bitter honey? Bitter honey. It wasn't chocolate. Good. But remember it wasn't the bitter chocolate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To me, candy's got to be chocolate. I don't know. Now, I do like, you remember I the Butterfinger of... commercial that was a spoof no, of Goldfinger? Let's hear it. It was like a James Bond spoof with a kid, and he was like, Bada finger. I don't remember it. You don't remember that? Now, do you, do you remember any <laughs> costumes when you were a kid? Remember it's any funny. Costumes? I was trying to think of costumes. I remember I had this, like, New York Mets full wool uniform. Uniform. So you went as a Met ball I think player. I might have done that one, a couple of times. One year, uh, Millie, our, our mother, uh, she dressed Michael up as Batman. And I was his assistant, right. also Batman. Right. So we were Batman and Batman. Well, she used to dress us as Michael and I like twins. Remember we had those masks that you would, it had the rubber band around oh, it. Oh, the mask. And you'd put the mask over your face and your face would sweat. I think I was Spider-Man yeah. one year yeah. uh, with that. And the masks were mask good, on. but you couldn't really see what was going on and they irritated the face. Right, so when th- someone was throwing like an egg at you or yeah. something. You now, wait a minute. Now, growing that. up in New York. Yes. Now, wait. When we got older, you had to be careful. The later you went trick-or-treating because you would get eggs. They were the, the some kids would hang out in the in the trees in the in all the, the crazies around on Halloween. Look out for the crazies. <laughs> Now the old man is that a Mr. Goodball? Our old man hated Halloween because he said, as a kid, yeah. the bigger kids in Coney Island would steal your candy from yeah, you. Yeah, it was even more destructive. And I don't know wherever you're listening, whoever's listening, but back east it could get a little crazy. You get egged, and sometimes there were firecrackers. Anyway, I remember good times. And uh, what about the? Did I ever tell you about Millie? Uh, this is the second uh, reference to our mom, but this is being a kid. One year, I don't know what it was, but we were all out, and we couldn't. 
trick or treat. And so you, you and Melissa were very young. Right. And Michael and I wanted to go trick or treating. We didn't have a costume. And Millie's like, "I'll take you. We'll go to a couple of houses." <laughs> and she put a like a sheet, <laughs> one sheet over me and Michael and Millie, and we were like a big ghost kind of. But after like ten houses. We were starting to get egged. She's like, Jesus, run for it. So they were so egging you because yeah. you were just out yeah, after but we got a, nine. We got a couple of Three Musketeers and Nestle's and a Mr. Goodball. <laughs> yeah. Now, what kind of uh, – you mentioned the Mad Monster Party. Yeah. Well, now, what, what, let's talk What movies. other kind of movies do you remember? I remember Abbott and Costello being Frankenstein. How about this movie? What is that movie? Come on. Thomas, this is Ghostbusters. Oh, yeah. well, that's, that's a great that's Halloween late. movie. <laughs> much later in uh, in life, Ghostbusters. We didn't have the music ever in the middle of the act. This I guess it's, it's a new thing, Tom. It's Ghostbusters is a great uh, a great uh, like it's not horror, really a sc- horror comedy. But it's, yeah, it's not really a scary movie. I mean, Abbott and didn't... Costello meet Frankenstein okay. scared me when I was little because you didn't want to see Luke Costello get get He's in trouble. He's such a sweet guy, and to see like something as scary as Frankenstein. Yeah, yeah. but you know what? You him, know what scared kind of... me when I was a kid? The Blob, the original Blob. Oh, with Steve McQueen. Steve McQueen made for like hardly no money, low budget. But there was a scene in the Blob where when the what the hell is that? That's Halloween. Yeah, I never saw it. Yeah, I can't really never quote seen any Halloween, of those Halloween Never movies. seen Freddy Krueger, never seen uh, Friday the 13th, never seen them. So we're not really guys that can talk about scary movies because we but don't really gonna, like scary I was going to say one thing about The Blob. There was a scene when The Blob comes in a movie theater. In the movie, uh, the blob comes through the that's right. the project the projector. That's and right. when I went to the movies next, I kept turning around checking just to make in sure. Case came out. Well, what about what are scary? Look out for the blob. Now, what about movies that are just scary? It doesn't have to be necessarily a Halloween themed scary movie. movies. Like what is a scary? To me, Alien is. Well, I'll just scary say movie. the original Alien yeah. is probably one of the scariest movies yeah. I've never ever seen because I, you have to wait for the entire. That's scary. You don't really see it; it's implied. Yeah, you know? I don't like it. Remember that like cat? It. There's a cat in Alien right, that does some okay. great acting. Well, you don't like cats. You've never liked. I don't cats. mind cats. I just I mean, don't you like, like cats. I don't mind cats. I just don't mind aliens. I love cats. Delicatessen. That's a really great place. Yeah, you change the subject. And but cats, the cats. musical. Cats, the musical. <laughs> you get a free pastrami sandwich with every matinee. But anyway, what are folks, other scary movies? What are, you know? American what? Werewolf in London. Oh, Do you remember that? Scary movie. Everybody went to see that. Remember I was that? working as an usher. My first job in the business, Tom. Oh, usher. Exactly. And uh, that was a very scary movie. What other films did you see when you were working uh, at the movie theater? That were horror-themed? Well, yeah, I, well scary. we scary. had the sequel to Alien called Aliens, yeah, the sequel. the James Cameron movie, which is actually an excellent movie because it gives you what Alien didn't have, which was just thousands and thousands of these aliens thrown at you yeah, in every much. direction. Yeah. Have you right. seen Alien versus... Uh, wait, that's, that's a list. Don't touch Alien versus list. Schwarzenegger. No, yeah, I'm just, yeah. Come on, you alien. Good. Alien versus Rocky. Uh, come on, I can take you on. Come on. <laughs> Adrian, it's an alien! You mean, <laughs> alien! They haven't, they haven't made that yet? Made, no, that'd be a great one. Rocky well, you versus know, the alien. Getting back, if we can, to Halloween. If yeah, you okay, remember... Well, wait, wait, hold on. If you remember, September, Labor Day, you went back to school. But by the time you got to September, it's all over. Because you know Halloween's coming, Thanksgiving's coming, Christmas is coming. So... So it's very festive. It's the night before Halloween as we record this. That's right. And we're in your house. And your neighborhood here really does it up here in well, West yeah, L.A. I mean, I kind and of it's very festive. And, and you can walk around. And I like to come here and hand out candy. And I like to see the little kids. I know? love Halloween. I've always loved Halloween. Yeah. But I think I kind of rediscovered it once we, we had kids of our own. Because well, you, you go through the whole thing you again. You go through all of it again. The kids dress up. You yeah. take them out. Yeah. But now, like, there's a block in our neighborhood where right. you go at a certain time. And it's like the, they close the block. Yeah. Yeah. The parents are. What do they gi- have? They're them? giving out Light. wine. They're giving out oh. food. They're yeah. giving out cheese for the parents. The yeah. kids can all run amok up the street. Yeah. Each house is decorated like like it's Disneyland or something. They, they really make it look fantastic. Alien! Yeah, it's great. It's very festive. <laughs> Come on, what kind of alien are you? I'm going to destroy you. I'm going to terminate you. But you know, getting back to the candy, I remember you got. Give the, me your Zagnut. Do you remember the the corn? The, the uh... oh, I hate candy corn. Right. So no one liked the candy. That was corn. always left. So that July was the 4th. last thing that, left. July Fourth yeah, yeah, yeah. always had it. Oh, I got some candy corn. Well, we're, I made wherever it. you are, we hope you have a great, 
great Halloween. It's a, it's you, you know when I when when we had when Veronica, my daughter, who's going to be sixteen soon, when she was little, uh, maybe uh, two three years old, we took her to her first. Oh, we figured we'd, we'd take her trick or treating. Right. So we knocked on the first door, and uh, <laughs> people opened the door, and Veronica goes in the house, and we ah. go, "No, no, no, honey, come back here, come back." And she's like, you know, and for the first three or four houses, she just went in. Everybody, because awesome. her thought was, "What we're knocking? Why can't we go That's in?" True. You know, I, I might try that this year. You get a lot of candy that, that way. That could work. You know. Yeah, you know, I also see a lot of the. Uh, uh, the kids come to the door, right. you know, and every year I, yeah. I I get to know the kids in the neighborhood, right? And I dress up in a, in a Dracula. Well, yeah, you so. and Jenny do something every year. You're Dracula, and she's Mrs. Dracula. Sort now, of. Will I they mean, will they be making an appearance tomorrow? Possibly. Well, that's I fantastic. Think so. Last year, I remember I was I was very upset for a lot of reasons on Halloween. I had a I actually I was in a play. It was a great play, right. a, a, a funny holiday show. And it was opening that week, so we had a dress rehearsal on Halloween. Oh, you don't so, want that. And and I believe it was Game Seven yeah. of the World Series, so I had right. to, I had to miss the whole thing. Dodgers lost the last Dodgers year, lost. and the Dodgers lost this year. So now no, we wait, turn the wow, page. Mike, wait, wait, we wait, turn the page wait, from baseball wait, wait, into wait, wait, full football, full basketball, wait, wait, full hockey. Wait, wait, bring that up. Just embrace it. Be in be in the reality, I'm Jonathan. Hurt. Be in I'm the hurt. I'm not at all. We turn the page. Hurt. Spring well, training. That's how you deal with it. You just kind of compartmentalize. No, no. I don't like baseball anyway. Wrong. I, uh, I get over things Feel the as pain, quickly Tom. as possible, especially in terms of baseball. Did they give you thrills? Did you have a good season? I was thrilled and delighted on many wonderful. occasions. And uh, it was a lot of fun. And, yeah. you know, alien! <laughs> and we had a good time together, you know. So <laughs> how much time is what left? What do you got on your list? How much time? That's, that, don't touch the list. How much time what is left? What do you left? got? Go down the list so that we can see what we got. Oh, Charlie Brown. Oh, the, yeah. Okay, the, so the good, the weakest of the Charlie Brown uh, trifecta. That's right. That's Would you the, agree? The great Pumpkin. Would you agree that the Great Pumpkin is the weakest? Yeah, I mean, of those what three. What the hell is he doing out there waiting for the pumpkin? Uh, it's, he wants the Great Pumpkin, Tom. That's and then Lucy hangs with him all night. and uh, You think maybe something's going to happen finally? And, and nothing and happens. She and, the she, football, and she and she gets pissed. It's the same old yeah, same. Yeah, it's you know, the same nothing old ever song. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I think, uh, yeah, so that was also something I looked forward to. Two on television. I got a rock. And, and all the sitcoms and all the TV shows always do silly Halloween episodes. The Halloween theme episode. None of which I can really recall. No, right I don't now. think I can't remember like the White Shadow Halloween yeah. episode. I can't remember that. <laughs> but I'm you sure there was You love that one. Ken Howard and you love the White, the white Shadow. How much time is left? On the Halloween show. That's How much you're time? almost done. How much time You've is left? You've been trying to leave as soon as you got How here. much time is I left? I got three minutes. Let's talk a little bit about the podcast. Now, right. uh, well, you, first of all, who's like listening? Me? Do you not like me? I don't really care for that much, to be honest with you. Oh, wait, I was Ringo Starr once, I remember, for Halloween. I don't understand. Say it again. I was Ringo Starr once for Halloween. I dressed up by Halloween. I'm just happy to be here. And then I was Joe Namath once. Oh, now you remember your... Uh, I mean, as weren't, you, weren't you Indiana Jones, too? I, I, that was my go-to uh, costume in... Uh, you know, as Indeed, I, as the I torch is going out. Yeah, so, sort of. Yeah, you know, I went through that. What's appropriate? How old can you still go trick-or-treating? Oh, remember 20. that? <laughs> no, I don't know. Well, remember back in New York, we were like, we're not going to go. We're not going to go. I'll, and then we're like, wait, I want to go. I want to get the candy. Wait, wait. I want to get candy. I want to go. So you would put on like dad's raincoat and you would be like, what a bum. That, that you know, a I'll be a bum, and I'll and I'll. Bum? You were the standard. They didn't call it. A, they like didn't a hobo. Yeah, well, you didn't like call it a homeless. You what didn't call it a homeless person back then. You called it being a bum. I am a hobo. Or being a hobo. Hand over your Mr. Goodbar. I'm that? a hobo, and I'm here for the good bar. <laughs> and, and, no, I remember one year, my buddies, uh, Steve Valley, Nick Pastis, Brian O'Keefe, shout out Eric Bankston, to the shout Edison, out to the Edison crew, to our gang. We used to call ourselves Utensil Lords from Nam, which makes no sense. Wait a minute. But wait, our gang. One that's a very scary our gang once, but it's racist. Oh, yum, 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 but wait. Go ahead. Uh, we went out. We were, we went out just normally, and we just sang at people's house. They opened the door, and we go, "Happy, happy Halloween! Happy, happy Halloween!" <laughs> did like, you oh, have, these kids are funny. And they did get, you have a costume? Here you go. You want a brownie with a razor blade in it? No, no costumes. How we is just that went, guy always here? He's everywhere. He's our one fan. He followed us out yeah. from New York, Tom. He was the Mister Good Boy. He doesn't sound the like Mister uh, the, the Mister uh, the ice cream guy. Not making sense. Right I'm now, not. Yeah. I, well, so, well, here we are. It's 14 minutes. 
and uh, 15 seconds. We wish, wish everybody, seconds. you know what, are you going to show a, a scary movie in the background tomorrow, like Abbott and Costello, you know, I've Nightmare about Before? i that uh, many times. Like, do you like the Tim Burton Night Before the night Christmas? Be- What's it called? Nightmare, Nightmare Before? Before Christmas? Boy, we're out of it. Wow. We should just show Abbott and Costello meet Frankenstein or The Blob, make everybody happy, or Rocky Balboa <laughs> as Alien. Well, Alien! This, or something like that. Well, this is on my Halloween We wish you books. many Mr. Good Bars. <laughs> So we'll and uh, look out for the superstitious superstitions That's of the world. Right. Look, uh, Halloween's a fun time. It's for the kids. Let's make it fun for them. Let's make it safe for them. Have and, a great uh, Halloween. Try to enjoy yourself, too. Trick or treat for UNICEF. That's yes. what we used to say when we were And we'll kids. be back soon with more episodes and all through the holidays. The holidays are coming, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, happy Halloween. Alien! <laughs>